and today I'm going to show you how to do something that I found very exciting. It's kind of simple, but it's exciting how to mask out an unwanted part of a video. So I just dropped in this um, free video I got, this uh, stock footage, and I'm going to hit play and show you what my problem is. And maximize this. Watch right up here. You're going to see some hikers walk by. And I would like to mask those guys out. So the way I'm going to do that is first I'm going to patch this source up to um, this other video track. So I have two of them. And then I'm going to hide the one that's underneath. So actually what's playing now is the, the top track. And we still have the hikers going by up here. So this is the one that I'm going to work with. So I'm open up the effects control panel and I'm going to add an opacity mask up here. I'm going to add an elliptical mask. Click that. You can see that it gives me these handles that I can resize. So I'm going to make this a little bigger so I can find where the hikers are. So let's scrub through the timeline. There they are, and there they go. So I want to make this mask be, oops, just need the size of what I need there. I don't even need it to be that big. So there they are. And now that I have my mask, I want to go back to a point before they walked in and I want to freeze the frame right there so that it's just going to play this static picture on this mask. And in order to do that, I'm going to right click on the track and I'm going to say add a frame hold right at that point. So if I play here, you will never see them appear within the, that little window. Now all I have to do is enable the visibility on the layer that's underneath. And you can see where that frame hold was applied right there. I can play this from the beginning. And the hikers never appear within the frame. So opacity is just a simple little effect. And um, I hope this helps you with your projects.